about the nature of the Ukrainian state, I mean, up until even even recently. I mean, in recent years, really since 2014, it has been getting better. There is a better atmosphere. Um, there's a younger generation, a new generation of people who are much more inclined to to think of the state as their state. Um, you know, there are a couple of very good universities in Ukraine that sort of specifically seek to cultivate that idea, you know, that public service is a good thing and, and people should do it. And then I think also the war meant that many people wound up serving, um, you know, either in the military or in, in other institutions um, out of a sense of, you know, fury and anger and patriotism. And I think the experience of this occupation or this, this invasion rather, um, however it ends, and there are many still dark scenarios. It's going to solidify However Ukraine ends, more than anything. It has already changed Ukraine. Um, the, the experience of being in the territorial army, um, the, the way in which people are working together will be remembered for a long time. Let me reintroduce you. If you're just joining us, my guest is Anne Applebaum. She's a journalist, a staff writer for The Atlantic, and a historian. Her books include Twilight of Democracy, The Seductive Lore of Authoritarianism, and Red Famine, Stalin's War on Ukraine. We'll be right back.